السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم on behalf of Marqas Sahaba the voice of Ahlu Sunnah wal Jama'ah we present to you lesson number 2293 of our daily nasiha and advice today with the grace and mercy of Almighty Allah Jalla wala we focus on the 8th of Shaaban Abu Bakr radiyallahu anhu sahabi this incident takes place there during Hajj qala khataba rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wasallam yawm an-nahr Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wasallam delivered the khutbah on the day of nahr nahr means to slaughter slaughtering camel faswalli li rabbika wa nahr when you slaughter goat sheep all that you call it zabah so when you drop the animal and antazbahu baqara the cow but camel you slaughter it sacrifice it while it's standing so that is called nahar faswalli li rabbika wa nahar read your eat salat then you slaughter so this was in mina on the 10th of zulhijjah on the 10th year after the hijra so 10th of zulhijjah and 10th year because 11th year nabi alayhi salam's demise took place for call during the khutbah, Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, لِيُبَلِّغَ الشَّاهِدُ الْغَائِبِ You who are present, you must convey, propagate this message to those who are absent. فَإِنَّهُ رُبَّ مُبَلَّغِينَ يُبَلِّغُهُ Many a time the person to whom you conveyed it, he will convey it further to other people and so forth. O ala u bin Sami'in, and he memorized it better than the one who heard it directly. So today we see we have the means, we have all this WhatsApp, we have radios, we have so many gadgets, so we can send with one press of the button to 100, 10,000, 50,000 people, so more and more people get conscientized, more and more people. So that is the fadl, the grace, and the mercy of Almighty Allah. And Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa made dua for such people. نظر اللهم رأى سميع مقالتي فبلغها that Allah Taala keep fair Allah Taala keep people energetic Allah Taala give people baraka and blessing so all that Allah Taala keep them with good health all that comes in there as well so Allah Taala put nur on their faces and so forth when they hear my speech the hadith mubaraka and then فبلغها and then they go and prop- Propagate it, teach it to others. The more we teach, the more love will grow for Almighty Allah, for Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wasallam. So we should always try and make tabligh. Tabligh means to propagate the message of the Messenger sallallahu alayhi wasallam to all Muslim and non-Muslim. Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa hadith Allah liyubaldi ghishahid me al ghaib so each one of you who are present propagate to those who are absent so remember that is our deen that today's people have hidden agenda ulterior motive and then they try and hijack the true message of Islam so we must take Islam which is the best and share it with the rest so in that way we will be fulfilling a great duty and a commandment of Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa obviously we must fulfill our duty with beauty may all Allah, all these ahadis are mentioned I am the Maja. may all Allah Allah accept us for his deen, make our khatima on iman and Islam. Ameen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.